kids, and welcome back to another episode of Sigils TV! Yay! We did it! Today's episode, we are learning about fashion, okay? I'm not very fashionable. I know you guys can tell. You've seen what I wear. But I'm trying to get a little bit better, and right? I'm trying to look less like a grungy gamer dude who lives in his closet. Wait, no. Who doesn't have anything in his closet. I don't know. The point is, um, we're, we're learning about fashion, and today we're going to put my skills to the test. We're checking out a video by a channel called Jubilee that does a whole bunch of really awesome social experiments and challenges. The video will be linked down in the description below. But here's how it works. They're bringing in a bunch of fashionistas, and they're going to have them guess whose outfit is the most expensive and who's the cheapest in like, the order, and then they're going to reveal it. We're going to see if I can do better than them, or if I am literally a clothing idiot. I think I know which one it's gonna be. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you do, make sure to hit the like button, okay? It really helps. Also, if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. I'm trying to get this channel 200,000 subs. We're real close. Let's go learn about fashion. If you had to rank yourself against others based on a specific Ooh. tree, what okay. would you say about how you see them? Interesting. And how they see you. We brought together seven people who love fashion and asked Dude. them to arrange each other based on how expensive they think each other's outfits are. Then we rearranged them based on okay. how expensive their outfits actually. So just right off the bat, I know Essentials is a good brand, but I don't think it's super expensive. I assume that the people who are wearing things I don't recognize are going to be the most. Like this looks pretty cheap to me, right? Which also might mean it's super expensive, but like it's pretty like normal. You know what I mean? Like. People wear that out all the time. People wear this in LA all the time. I don't ever see somebody dressed like this. That makes me think it's expensive. This also looks expensive to me. Uh, they all might be expensive. I hate this. Um, but also, I have sneaking suspicion that this or this is the most expensive. And then I'm thinking this is the least or this. But we'll see, okay? Actually, you know what? You know what? Okay, all right, all right. You know what? Here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. I am gonna make my bet right now. And I'm, I'm allowed to change it, but we should at least come up with something right now, okay? Here's my order so far, okay? I think Sandy is the most expensive, okay? Then George, then Rhino, that's a dope name. Then Ryan, okay? And then Rob, and then uh, Bridget, and then Sam. I don't know why I didn't capitalize Rhino. Sorry, Rhino. That's, that's my theory and I'm sticking to it. Editor, you can screenshot this and use it. Um, here we go. All right, so this is Sandy. Sandy's gonna organize people like what she thinks. I the creator a lot. He has a really eclectic style that has changed over the years, but I also okay. am inspired by like Justin Bieber. I, I like really his like hat. To pick and choose and take different pages from different people's books. I feel comfortable when I wake up in the morning and I'm like, oh, I want to wear this certain vibe, even though like right now I kind of look like a toddler, like a little kid. <laughs> no, she's got like a casual vibe going on. I, I like it. I tip it. Okay. I'm inspired by. I put on clothes sometimes. New York City queer scene, nature. Um, yeah, hers is like for sure more expensive, dude. Every time I dress myself, because how or maybe not? Maybe she's a big thrifter. Myself out loud and I don't know. Share my expression. I might be I changing really like my answer about like fashion as a story. I feel like for me, fashion is like almost like a fun way to like experiment with gender, gender expression. It doesn't have to like. There's like no rules to it, and there's dude, his always glasses. Like, some, like, I, all I can see is the glasses halfway down. Oh. <laughs> Yo, is there about to be a change? Since you've all done the reveal you wanted to do, do you want another chance to do it? Oh. <laughs> Come on, George. Uh, I think it was the gloves. I didn't I didn't practice with the gloves. It's What do you got, George? Oh! oh! Wow, okay, did not see that coming. Duty vibe and Emma Chamberlain, I don't know if anyone knows. I love her like the way she dresses and just like This dude's like, yeah, we all know who Emma Chamberlain is. Styles. For the most part, me, I just like to go with really kind of an athletic casual. Uh, but every once in a while, I'll wear something really, really simple. Why is that? Why is that dude like not blinking? I don't want to be mean, but like he is staring through time and space right now. Do you guys see that? Am I crazy? Man, it's in another dimension. And then one piece of my clothing be just like kind of really far out there, kind of crazy or whatever. Oh yeah, did, did you do that today? <laughs> I love to be large and in charge. Like, I feel like yeah. my dress is literally like it's you don't the say. day of my life. Dude, I love the, the like I wear, sheriff like, belt she's got going on. Worn like this. Like, I could never skirt, pull any of well, I could pull the other skirt is a bandana. Like this is a vest worn like Yeah, okay, like you know what? Day. I don't think she's the most old. expensive anymore. I think she's probably got the most like style like like she and George are the most comfortable like trying stuff, right? Like they, they made their own like fits, right? These I think, ooh, I think, okay, I'm making an adjustment. I'm making an adjustment. I'm putting Rhino up at number one. And I'm bringing Sandy. Remember, this isn't how much I like it. This is just how much I think it costs. I'm bringing Sandy down to the bottom, okay? Um, yeah, 
Okay. Yep, that's that's my updated tier list or price list. There, you see people wearing expensive stuff, but then you can realize, oh wow, uh, I go to the thrift store and get some for five bucks. Uh oh. Uh oh. On it all day. Rhino's a thrifter. Uh oh. Like accessible thing. I was thrifting like middle school, and like you get. Pants Never mind. For $2. I'm changing. I'm changing my answer, dude. I'm panicking. I'm panicking. I'm panicking. Rhino. Rhino's going down here. All right. I no longer trust Bridget. I bet Bridget doesn't thrift. I'm putting Bridget up at the top. And now, like, Melrose Trading Post is just like, oh. I've been there. I'm so into thrifting right now, like $300, like, cup. George is thrifting. George is thrifting. <laughs> mayday, mayday, mayday. George is a thrifter. George is a thrifter. Uh, George and Sandy, remember those are the ones I had and wanted to? I'm moving them. Like, I'm moving is, them. And it's so sad almost, too, because yeah. it's like something that used to be accessible is now, like, tokenized. Now they must rank each other based on who they think is the most expensive outfit. Okay. I feel like you need to be in the back. Like the the cheap? Essentials, yeah. Okay, so. Ryan. You really? Really? Because you think I, Essentials is the cheapest? A hundo for the shirt. I'm going off of, you know, just kind of recognizing patterns. Yeah. It looks like you have a Burberry you tie <laughs> with like a Burberry shirt. But he might have thrifted I it. I don't know if that counts. can sometimes run itself at $500 plus. Is it real though? That's yeah, the question. Mm -hmm. I think she and Ryan should go. Yeah, together. I feel like I agree with that as well. Yeah, uh -huh. let's I go. think that it could be interchangeable. I, I don't know, man. Yeah. Air Jordans. Oh, he's got Air Jordans. Oh. oh. Yeah. Yeah. This is actually low key super fun because I don't know enough to know what's going on, right? Like when it looks at clothes, I don't even occur to me how much people spend on it unless it's like a watch covered in diamonds where you're like, yo, why? But this like. I don't really know. I, if you told me all of these costs roughly the same, I'd believe you. I would, I would put which I know is dumb. Kind of second in line. Yeah, I'm, because you have so many layers going on that I feel like it obviously just it's gonna add up. A leather yeah. on yeah. Sorry, yeah. Yeah. You might be this way. Pink. Now, just just to be clear, uh, they have her at number six. I have her at number one. I believe Ryan is this dude. So I have their two cheapest. I have is the most expensive, which makes me nervous. And then I have George. They have Sandy up there. Okay, so we're like we're like close because that's Rob and that's Ryan. Why do they all gotta have our names, man? Right here, I think that's like either cheap leather or plastic. Like that might be a kid's toy. Like the like I think I had one of those belts when I was a sheriff as a toddler. We had about the same hip size then. She is in great shape and I am not. Uh, but I don't I don't think she's that expensive at all. I I think all right. Here's where I'm getting nervous. They got George further down. I kind of, I kind of agree. I think I might have done George dirty by putting him that far down. I do think Ryan and Bridget are actually some of the higher ones. But Sam, I, I think I have Sam too low. Wait, I oh Rhino, they have Rhino number one. I don't anymore. <gasps> ah, I'm panicking. Okay, Rhino, Rhino's coming back up. All right, Rhino's going here, and Sam's going here. Actually, no, I'm doing that. I'm doing that. I'm doing that. But I, I am moving. I am moving Ryan. I don't think Essentials is like. That expensive? I'm doing that, okay? So now, my most expensive is still her, and then her, and then him, and then him, and then him, and then him. Wait, oh, no, 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 no. George I have pretty low down. Uh, George, I do think George is more expensive than than, than Ryan. Uh, okay, look, Ryan is essential. This is too hard. Too many R's. Okay, that's that's my updated list. <laughs> I'm panicking. Gonna be next to each other. Okay. I guess yeah. You guys are more hey, bestie. Uh, I would switch you two. <laughs> the Burberry is what was talking to me, and I'm not recognizing. I don't even know what Burberry is. I thought that was a spice. Brands. And then I'm looking at you and with the gloves, and you got. The, That's a good point. Gloves can be the, real the expensive. Purse or whatever that is. Oh, I thought you meant pants. I didn't uh, yeah. The pants yeah. look like they could be fitted or custom tailored, so I would okay. switch. Interesting. Okay. Okay. So he put. I mean, I have Sandy as the cheapest. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I'm excited. Let's find out. Spot number seven, we have Sandy. Go! Let's go. All right, so. I gotta mark this, okay? Boom. That's a check mark for your boy, all right? First one, completely correct. Let's go. With $99.96. Okay, all right. In spot number six, we have George with 100 points. Dang it, dude. Okay, spot number six is wrong, which means this one's wrong and this one's wrong. I had them together for so long, but I told you he was cheaper. I told you he was cheaper. Okay. Yeah, 
against us. Yeah. Yes. We did it. We got I knew it. I knew it, dude. Okay, it's pot number five. That means my Bridget is wrong. And <sighs> it's fine. It's spot number four. We have Ryan M with $475. Okay, Ryan. All right, I already had Ryan wrong. Okay, okay. In spot number three, we have Rob with 1900 Rob in number three. No, dang it. Wait, no, wait. Uh, actually, wait, no, that might be fine. No, no, I, I think I'm right. I think I'm right. I think I'm right. Wait, no, 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 no. Dang it, I'm not. Nope, I'm wrong. Ah, uh, dude, I, I got, I got dominated. Okay. Number two, we have Sam with I told you that was designer. Ah, oh, but she was okay. Wow, I really, I, I got destroyed. $60. Let me see. And in spot number one, we have Ryan with seventy-eight. Seventy-eight hundred dollars. How? It's a black shirt with white stripes on it! I am in the wrong business. I'm in the wrong business. I'm in the wrong business. What? Yay! Yay. Trying to pay for my tuition. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, dude. So, just to be clear, I was like kind of right in general, right? Like, so George was number seven and I, or six, and I put him at number five. Uh, right, like he, if I'd switch these two, they would both be right, or no. I'm gonna do this, okay? So the correct list is this. Oh wait, I got one right. Ah. Okay, so this list, just to make it more clear in case you're not sure what I did or didn't do correct. Uh, I got two right, okay? Sam was correct. So Rhino was one, I got that wrong. But I had him in the top three, okay? Sam, I got correct. Rob, I had within one place of himself. Ryan. Uh, I was pretty wrong on. Uh, Bridget, I was the most wrong on, uh, I think. George, I had him off by one place. And Sandy, I got right. So actually, I was very close on a lot of these. So I don't feel like as much of an idiot as I could. All right, well, we learned a lot about fashion and that I'm both better and worse at it than I thought I would be. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, do me a favor, hit the like button. Make sure you're subscribed. Also, tell me uh, what clothing I should buy or something. I don't know, down in the comments below. And I'll see you guys in the next Sigils TV.